Hi everyone and welcome to codingjust.com. Guys, in this video, I will show you how you can get data from your API using Retrofit with Coroutines. So this is our project and we will be using this JSON placeholder API and we will get the comments from this API. And uh, first of all, we uh, need to add some dependencies. So go to your build.gradle and you will find these uh, three dependency in the description below. You can copy it from description and add it to your uh, build.gradle and click on sync. And the second thing is uh, you need to add the internet permission in your Android manifest file. And uh, after adding the internet permission, uh, this is our API uh, interface. Okay, so you can just simply create a new interface like simply click on uh, right click on this new um, Kotlin class file and select uh, interface from here and give a name. Okay, so I already created it and what I will do here, I will create a request here. So I, it will be a get request. So simply type get and I will add a endpoint here, which is the comments for, for the API and uh, I will create a suspend function here this is a coroutine function and I will name it get uh, comments and this function will be the type of response and the response will be the list of comments okay so I already created the comments data class here as you can see so we have body email ID name and post ID and uh, I will also show you the response this is uh, the api response uh, we are getting all the comments in the json form here okay so we have post id name email and body so we'll get back to our project now what we will do here we will create a function here so private one get all comments and inside this function we will create the people but first let me call this function here okay what you will do simply type well api it will be equal to retrofit dot builder builder with capital b and uh, dot base url and as you can see i have already created a base url here and i will just simply pause this variable here dot uh, add converter factory so simply type json json converter factory dot create and now i will build this simply build and then create the api and inside this create what we will pass we will pass our interface class which is uh, my api and uh, class.java and below here we will uh, call this api using coroutine so what i will do i will just simply uh, create a global scope and uh, it will we will launch it and it will be the type of dispatchers so dispatchers dot io it means input output okay and inside this coroutine function uh, we will uh, get the response so simply type well response and uh, api dot get comments okay and uh, uh, if you know we uh, this uh, function is the type of response so we can get it uh, directly from here and now what we will do we will simply check if response is successful then we will log all the comments or email from the api inside this so simply create a for loop here for comment in response sorry uh, response dot body and uh, add the null here null check here and inside this for loop i will just simply create a log and i have already created this tag uh, here which is the check response and in the get all comments what i will do i will just simply type comment dot uh, email so we will get all the emails okay now uh, i will run my application and let me clear this log get for now okay so as you can see we are getting all the emails from the api okay this is all the emails and uh, let me show you if you if you uh, if you want to call the retrofit api uh, without using the coroutine so this is the api call without coroutine as you can see how much code is here and we are uh, creating multiple threads here like on response on failure so 
it is the best practice to uh, use retrofit uh, to call retrofit inside your coroutine and uh, using the coroutine will uh, save you time for writing much more code okay so that's it for that's it for this video guys and if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos